Hey everyone, James and Mark here with another video. We are on vacation right now, um, but we noticed that we did not, I guess we did on Monday say we weren't gonna go on live, but we might spontaneously go on live and here we are. This so, is our spontaneous moment. Spontaneous moment. We are just hanging out in our uh, room. Hedu's here on vacation with us. How exciting Woo! that Hedu's here on vacation. We actually were able to use our stream yard to spy on him all day, which has been really great uh kind of using it as like a doggy cam so uh tonight all we have planned is uh we're probably going to get some drinks because we're going to uber to dinner we have dinner at like 7 30. i see a lot of you are here in the chat hi everybody um so yeah that's really all what we have planned today we went to the aquarium earlier today we had breakfast we had lunch we went to a jazz festival i took a cat nap mark was watching a very intense korean drama this is what vacations are made of, y'all. Just doing whatever the heck we want and not having a care in the world. The view, I have to say, is nothing short of gorgeous. We basically are facing the ocean. The ocean. <laughs> like um, literally oceans right there. Yeah. I wonder, maybe I could invite my like self to it and like, show up. Yeah. Maybe that might be a cool way to do that. So maybe I'll, I'll get to that in a second. But uh, actually, really quick, I should do it first because it's sun setting. Let me see how I can invite. Okay, do this while Mark entertains you and with Hedu getting a treat. Sit. Breathe, breathe, spin. Sit. Down, down. Breathe, breathe, sit. Hope you're all doing really well. We miss you. I know it's been like two Fridays of not doing our regular lives, but. Are you just the otter that we saw earlier at the aquarium? Yeah. We, Do you we, think he would we, be friends or would we, he steal the food? Oh, no. They were stealing each other's food today. It was kind of sad. sad. <laughs> now, do you want to be the ocean correspondent and then I'll control things here? Sure. Okay, give me a get everything set up on here for you first. So Mark's actually gonna go out on the balcony and show you. I'll turn off the mic for us. Yeah, time. I'll turn off everything. I mean, technically you'll be over there, so, but yeah. Uh, I call it the spy cam, we call it the ocean cam. It is dark cam though. Yeah. On here, you turn off the cam. So I'm going to have you go. Yeah. There we go. Are you on? Yeah. There. You can, you can do it. Oh. I, uh, I need to turn this on. Oh. And we need a different mover. <laughs> Good thing I brought it. Yeah. Okay. So Mark's going to take you all out to our uh, balcony you could see the ocean and you can do it landscape so it fills the screen there you go all right let's let's take a look at what what we can see here so you flip in the camera on you just see his there we go look at that this is what this is what we've been doing here so it's kind of sunset we're, we're really happy that it um cleared up Yesterday it was a little bit um, rainy and really overcast, so it's quite nice. Mark, can you hear me? If you can hear me, give me a thumbs up. Oh, maybe he's just he's just focused on showing you <laughs> the ocean. We're in the a corner unit, so like. We haven't really seen anybody come by this way, but, and uh, don't worry, we've been vlogging all weekend too. So you'll see this video at some point in time, but isn't that nice? The only thing is, is like last night though, the waves were like crashing quite a bit and like, it was really hard to sleep. It wasn't like the soothing YouTube loop waves crashing. It was like the, Oh my God, like, like, are the waves going to hit our room, even though we're on like the fourth floor or whatever? 
So let's uh so while you guys all enjoy that, let's say hi to everybody really quickly. We got Journey with Nancy, Allison, Joy, Gemma, Beatrice, Nancy. Thanks for dropping by, everybody. I'm gonna close that out. Okay, you're good. I'm just saying hi to everyone really quick. We have uh, Gigi, Bonnie, Elaine, Emerita, Donna, Colleen. Mr. How, H is still here, yeah. How did it look? Because I couldn't see it. Oh, it was great. Everyone said it was such a nice view. Did it look like the ocean? Mm -hmm. You had very steady hands, too. Even though it Mark's so hair, <laughs> Mark's hair was like all the way back, and I was just like, yeah. I was afraid that the phone was going to knock out of my hand. We actually just did something really funny with Hedu's hair. Stay, stay tuned for the vlog. You'll see what happened in there, but it was quite funny. Uh, Cindy says, miss you madly. Uh, we'll be back soon. Elaine says, love your drink with the sand James. Yeah, we're not, if we get drinks tonight, we're not going back there for drinks. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not about that. Miss Mari and Linda, welcome. We have Mike here as well. Do, do they even do room service here? I wonder if we could just order the drinks in there, but their phone system does not look <laughs> like it has that capability. Well, good thing the restaurant is on the same floor as us. True. We have Kennedy, cute sweatshirt, James. Thank you. Mark got this for me. How funny. Mike is drinking Chardonnay from Monterey. Oh. There you go. We've been having a lot of Monterey wines yeah. this weekend. Dante says, how are the handsome dude doing? We're great. Joyce says, Hedu is getting thick. Is he getting thick? Hedu, yeah. you're not going to take that from Joy, are you? Yeah, you're so, so, so. Sit. Hey, sit. Sit. Hey, sit. Look at our little family vacation right here. Oh, my gosh. How cute. Foxy Brown, babe. Welcome. Linz, welcome. Sorry if I'm not getting everyone's comments. We're just on a different setup than usual. Yeah, so we're just visiting Monterey for another few days. I see Eddie is here. Welcome. What are you all up to this Friday night? What's everyone doing? You guys have earned this time to relax. We are definitely relaxing. Chow's dropping by and saying hello. Yeah, we wanted to go on before. See, the lights are starting to do the the not so cute lighting. Now. Oh, because the sun is setting. The sun is setting, so. The beginning of the stream was beautiful. Foxy Brown Babe says, I love anything with water. Should we just make all of our lives in front of the beach? <laughs> Evelyn, welcome to the live stream. Uh, we are very far from you, actually, right now. Uh, maybe six hours north of you. We're actually in Monterey this weekend. I'm drinking box wine tonight. There you go, Joey, and ordered a pizza. Lots of fans of your shirt, Mark. Rush Girl says, I love Mark's peanuts. Thank you. Who else complimented you on it today? Uh, the Korean worker. Oh, there we go. See? We got Chrissy and Garrett. Welcome. Kevy Do. So nice to see. Yeah, Hedy's been enjoying it. He was a little, I mean, we did a lot to make sure he felt uh, acclimated to it. But uh, today we, we set up the camera so that we could just check on him and Basically, he was just sleeping on all four corners of the bed. So he's been on vacation himself, too. But we actually, you know, yeah, so our dinner plans are at 730. We're thinking of trying to get a drink before then, take Hedy on an evening walk, and then head out, get our Uber. I don't know, should I try and get us a drink? Let's see if you can get that far, yeah. And then... And if they say no, then it's... Then, then it's a done deal. It's okay. So don't go downstairs far. Well, that's where I got the sand. <laughs> and is it rude to be like, okay, can I get a gin tonic without the sand? <laughs> well, okay. that's That just shows how close we are to the... Literally, right outside of the hotel is a private beach. And the waves right here. Our room, we're on the fourth floor. Yeah. So this is the top floor, and we just have unobstructed view of the ocean. 
Plus, the thing that Mark says that he really likes is like, there's no oil rig, there's no ships, there's nothing. It's just it's ocean, just open waters. And if you just joined, you could watch the replay of this. We're not going to be on for that long, so uh, we actually took the camera outside so you can all get a glimpse of it before. Technically, it, you, could, I, you could just unplug the laptop and you could go outside again. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> Michelle, hi. Hope you guys have a great vacation. Thank you. Amy says hello. Welcome. Chris says so glad you're having a good time. Yeah, it's been great so far. Sand in your drink. Yes, I posted on my Insta story last night. Everyone thought I was buzzed in that one, too, but I was more or less just sassy and appalled, <laughs> which <laughs> so I guess is my, my buzz self. Sand in his cocktail. I, I thought it was sugar at first, but then I, I, you know, I, that's one of the reasons why I'm not typically a beach person is because I hate the feeling of when sand gets in your mouth, like, I don't know, from a gust of wind or whatever. And so I was like trying to, get the sugar out of my mouth and I started crunching. I was like, this doesn't seem right. And then Mark grabbed my glass and looked at it from underneath and you could see all the grains of sand. So. What are y'all doing on a Friday night? What are you doing? What are you eating dinner? What are you drinking? Chardonnay from Monterey. Oh. <laughs> Mike says, when you're on a cruise to the Caribbean, all you see is water, which lets you know that you're really, really far away from home. I mean, if I just look out in the open water, we could be in our room on a cruise ship. True. It, it yeah. It feels that way. Like we're in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Earlier, there was a... So we, we walked along the coast earlier, and then there was like these staircases to go down to the ocean. And then we... We were like, oh, maybe we should go check it out. And then we realized if you go down the steps, it's the ocean. Yeah. There's no, no like water. beach or sand. Yeah, it's just... just very little beach part. Where yeah, yeah. The waves were already going to the down, uh, to the last steps of the stairs. But I say from, like, honestly, if we went downstairs all the way we could, it's probably the length of where we do our normal lives to the end of the hallway and maybe times two. Yeah. So it's really close. Hedu is really good um, not having separation anxiety. Yeah, he doesn't we, we trained him really well, I think, or Mark did um, early on. It's because... It's great training, it's too. It's because we separate. <laughs> You're like, you have no choice but to be separated from us right. for a long period of time. And Hedu is very independent. Super independent, yeah. Sometimes he doesn't want us to be at home. Maribel's drinking wine. We, okay, wait, let's figure out the drink situation. Yeah, should we just get wine then? We've been drinking a lot of wine this weekend, too. Whatever's easiest. You want red or white? I've only been drinking red, but I'm like, it's cold up here, so now I don't really feel like white. So red? I, I yeah. Try at the bar. Let's just try it real quick and then. Kind of shedding because there's the change of the season. But he's like, Yeah, you can't really see him, but let me, but then he's let me like, just do this real quick. But it's cold up here. Show everyone the the floof ball that you grab. This has only been how however long you've been doing this for. Yeah, like a couple of seconds. Look at that. We're using like a, this is a makeshift setup, y'all. This is not our normal. We're using a Microsoft Surface. It's not even a real laptop. Yeah. Maribel lives in Florida or loves Florida. I've used a beautiful lake and we have swans. Uh, we have Sean in the house. Hi, Sean. How was Korean barbecue last night? Okay, uh, you need to tell us, because I was very curious, like, what is Korean barbecue like in Florida? Alligator meat. <laughs> Alligator kalbi. Crocodile bulgogi. Yeah. 
Nicole says, we both have a birthday to celebrate tomorrow. Happy birthday, James. Thank you so much. Yeah, what are we doing tomorrow, James? Uh, we're going to do a lot of uh, sightseeing. There's this, there's like a 17-mile stretch that you can drive. Uh, and there's a lot. Actually, that's what we need to do after dinner is figure out what the what point of interest. We actually want to get out of the car. We're going to take Hedy with us, so have lunch. And then we have dinner reservations at this pretty modern-looking restaurant tomorrow night. Yeah. Kind of pricey, but it's well worth it. Yeah. I realize how much I look forward to your lives, especially when you don't plan to have one, right? Just, I mean, you, got, you know what? One of these days, we might stop doing these. So you milk it while you can, you know? Spontaneous. And Sean has oh! sponsored our drinks for tonight. Get some drinks tonight, courtesy of Thong Sang. Thong Sang. Okay. Thong Sang. Yes. We sing, but Thong Sang. <laughs> What should we drink? Should we do oh, yeah. cocktail? Why don't you decide? Yeah, decide. Uh, the people next door to be like, what are these guys doing? Don't say it. <laughs> Actually, it's, I don't feel like I hear anybody here because the ocean's so yeah, loud. Yeah, the, 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 wave, the waves here on this side of Monterey is crazy. Like, I'm surprised I don't see any surfers because it kind of looks like a mini tsunami every yeah. single wave. There wouldn't be like restrictions on being able to surf here, right? No, I, so. I just feel like it's such a big wave here. So, anyways, okay, ready? Um, Sean, 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 thank, thank you. you. We appreciate you. Sean probably loves that as soon as he's saying "heavy love." <laughs> he literally, like, as soon as he, he starts, walked away. he walked away. He's like, "I'm not having any." Thank you again. Yeah, let us know what we should drink. Larice, welcome to the live stream. Lainey, welcome. It's not my birthday today. It's mine's tomorrow and Mark's is Wednesday. So it's like our birthday. Should we do another celebration? Is live midnight tonight. To say <laughs> happy birthday. Uh, we are not. Uh, we're going to Carmel for dinner, but we're not staying in Carmel. Stray Cat's hometown is Monterey. Excellent. A lot of Pisces in the house. Everyone's really happy about that. Nicole, thank you so Aww. much for the $5 super chat. Nicole, 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 thank you. We appreciate you. Thank you so much for that. So kind. We have Tony here. Hey, beautiful boys. Hi. Are you enjoying it? Well, so now it's, uh, well, Mardi Gras season is over, but did you get to enjoy? Oh, Mardi Gras. Yeah. Fat Tuesday was this week, huh? Yeah, it was two Fat Tuesday and then Ash Wednesday. Go to Robata, a Japanese restaurant, one of my favorites. So we'll have to add to our list. Our, we uh, actually, this past week, we mapped out exactly what the entire trip was going to be. So it's been nice because we already did the planning. We did all the planning. And now when we come back to Monterey, we're excited to try out new places. Yeah. A lot of our, uh, the Uber drivers are really friendly up here. I think more so than where we live. Yeah. Very, very um convert like they if you're if you're yeah, if you're the kind of person that doesn't Even want to the, talk. The first guy last night, yeah, he looked like he was like mean and he drove so fast, like you know, like a oh yeah. Like, yeah. Mm, but then I was like, like this guy's not I'm, he's not gonna be a talker, right? Yeah. But he started talking to us like <laughs> I forgot where it was either when I booked the ride or after the ride, but there's a section where it tells you like what their main like good attribute is and his was a uh, good conversationalist really yeah wow but like, yeah yeah you didn't get the vibe judged a book by no no no, no no yeah he looked all serious <laughs> yeah hi ray welcome to the live stream oh so what are we drinking again with Deshaun? oh uh, Deshaun say anything he just said boy so what do you think, Sean? What are y'all? Where are y'all going for dinner? It's um, I think we're going to a Mediterranean spot tonight, actually. Foxy Brown Babe's birthday is on Tuesday. Yeah, I think we're gonna do a birthday-related stream, like combine our birthdays and do something fun with y'all. Oh. Hi, Ellen. Happy early birthday to you, beautiful souls. Thank you. thank you, Anna. Thank you so much for the early birthday wishes as well. Are so sweet. Allison said this past Ash Wednesday for Lent started 30 days of drinking. So maybe it's helpful that we don't do our normal like 
heavy drinking on a Friday night for Allison this week. Because usually I think Allison drinks with us while we do the stream. Uh, but so she gave it up for Lent. Yeah. Get some martinis. But they're probably like the the, the most difficult <laughs> thing to bring back with the gust of wind. But I mean, uh, she's, maybe ask for like a different kind of pot. I don't know. Okay, no. well, you, you got your mission then. I don't know if I want to carry two glasses of martini. No, no, you have, I mean, it's just... really windy outside, Sean. Order a drink and have it with us. Well, that's the plan, but I don't know if we'll, we'll be. We're going to try. I think uh, we could do. Oh, we got a super chat. Oh, but I'm just thinking like, what's it easier to carry in the gust of wind? Tio, thank you for the five dollars super chat towards your g-string budget. How much does a g-string even cost? I'm sure I can find one that's five dollars. Is it floss? <laughs> Just take their underwear and just really hike it up. But it'll be, oh, well, that works too. All right. Tiho, Tiho, thank you. We appreciate you. Thank you so much. Okay, so now Sean is switching gears saying Moscow meal. The tin mugs won't break even if they fall. Oh, that's true. They probably won't send us home with the tin mugs, but I think, yeah, that could be a drink too. Yeah, I'll, I'll just see. Okay, everyone. They might, is, they might not even. Let you even let you, back. yeah. But so, we'll see. Everyone, cross your fingers. I'll be back. Mark is being sent on a covert. Is that co covert mission? Co op covert. I'm not. Oh. And we got another super sticker from Stray Cat. Thank you for the ten dollars super sticker. I, you're gonna get solo right now. Stray Cat, Stray Cat. Thank you. We appreciate you. Thank you so much for that $10 super sticker. Y'all are so kind. We just came on just to say hello. So uh, all these super chats are super, super nice. Thank you so much. Loanne says, hi, guys. What a nice surprise to see you on tonight. And we'll have to watch the beginning. Oh, yes. Uh, so the beginning, um, we were just able to show you the view from our room. It's gotten a lot darker since. So Hedu is a... a, a Give you a quick glimpse of Hedu. Just didn't want you guys to have to like stare at our bathroom. He's just chilling. He's been a really good boy this trip. Ooh. Let's see. Ooh, old fashions. Yeah, because we're like, we might as well just drink. Because we're gonna Uber to the restaurant anyway, so maximize it. What is cold to y'all? I mean, what is the what is the weather right now? It's fifty degrees right now. That's cold to born and raised Californians. Sorry if I mean obviously it's colder in other parts of the world, but. Yeah, Hedy's just enjoying his time, just chilling. Of course, Evelyn, thank you for coming on. I really appreciate what you guys do for us. It's just, yeah, our schedule's just been really, really crazy. Uh, we're also plan. we have another vacation slated um, this month, too. So that'll probably throw one of our lives out the window as well. So we'll try our best to kind of keep you posted on our schedule. Um, yeah, I heard that it's raining. As soon as we got here, we found out it was raining in SoCal, too. So, Noah's World, welcome to the live stream. So, if you're wondering where Mark is, he has the task of... Oh, my God, someone's trying to go in the water right now. That's crazy. Uh, he is on a mission to see if he can get drinks for us. Uh, we got to leave very soon. Go to the aquarium. Uh, we spent the morning at the aquarium. We were there for about two hours, maybe an hour and a half. It was beautiful. Um, yeah, we got to see sea otters. There was really magnificent um, jellyfish. And then there were two displays that were like basically large tanks that emulate 
the ocean floor. And so there was just all types of sea creatures in one tank. That was probably one of my favorite spots um, in the exhibit. So if you're ever in Monterey, I highly recommend it. It is a little, I mean, it's $50 a ticket. I'm sure there's discounts out there, but I thought it was well worth it. We were thoroughly entertained. So we'll be here, um, we're making our drive back on Sunday. So tomorrow we have like a self-guided 17 mile tour that we're gonna be doing. Just the air or the heater, something just turned on. It's really, the jellyfish, amazing. Yeah, it was, it was magical. I love the aquarium there, it's, yeah. We did see an octopus, but it kind of gave me uh, the chills because it was the underside of the octopus that was like kissing the the glass, and it, it yeah I had that I never had tryptophobia until I met Mark, and then once Mark kind of kept freaking out about it, and I started looking at it, I was I started getting grossed out by it, and so when I saw that he actually is not bothered by the the octopus as much, which I found surprising. He did not like though. There was there was a tank of I think it was sardines and they were they were swimming in like a circle pattern and they would unhinge their gills and like he did not like how they were opening and closing and it did kind of look gross after a while. <laughs> we are not in Hawaii. I wish we were in Hawaii. That'll probably be a future trip soon. Um, the 17 mile drive is beautiful. Lots of photo ops. Well, I will make sure I get my hair did. I got my cute outfit on for all that tomorrow. The sea elephants. No, where are the sea elephants? Is that something separate? We enjoyed fresh fish at the restaurant at the Monterey Aquarium. I was wondering whether we were eating some of the exhibits. Well, one of the tanks had bluefin tuna and I was like, ooh, bluefin tuna sounds kind of good, but it did seem a little odd to have it like just swimming around. What is that? Sucking on my what? Like you wanted me calling me all the time? It, it sounds that that sounds like a lyric. <laughs> the octopus was giving you a Brenda birthday kiss. Hi Brenda. Okay, so I don't know. It's been, a, it's been a little bit of time. Maybe, well, actually it is also, it might be happy hour right now, so there might be a line. Okay. Well, we'll send Mark our good thoughts that maybe we can get a drink in before we have to leave. Uh, thank you so much, Asam. Happy birthday, thank you. Uh, uh, for our family, um, and we just hope that things get better for everybody else, too. Can you imagine? <gasps> Key Buddy says, Mark decided to enjoy drink by himself instead. You know, his prison boyfriend might be up here. They might have planned a rendezvous. Maybe that means he's getting the drinks made. We will see. Ooh, but yeah, this lighting. Oh, maybe if I go back, it's a little bit more flattering. It's a lot of shadows in here. Though it kind of makes me want to paint, like we've been thinking about it, it kind of makes me want to paint like our uh, walls blue. Ooh, you know what? Maybe I can do like a hack where I use my phone light, 
might be obnoxious, though. Let's see how this turns out. Are we testing things around here? Is that better? Or now you see like this glare? How's that? Uh, good night, Bonnie. The placement of those photos right on top of each other is a choice. <laughs> How would you do it? Oh, I guess side by side. Oh my gosh, Mark is here. I'm going to add him to the stream. <laughs> Hello, Mark. Oh, he's got the camera. Can you hear us? Can you hear me? Are our drinks getting made? What's happening? Give me the lowdown. Oh, he, so he's at this kitchen here. And I guess he's getting the drinks made. Something that's being muddled. Mark, are you? can you hear me? Okay, that was it. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> what is this live correspondent breaking news reporting, y'all? You know what? Like, we just thought <laughs> you would enjoy that. Living is KTLA fantasy, but me as a news anchor, I'm like, his microphone is not working. We need we need uh, to hire some IT. This is a two person operation. It's not it's not cute, but it looks like something's getting muddled. Do Moscow mules get muddled? Maybe it's not a Moscow mule. Hey, Moose says, James, I need you to play Elden Ring. I can't emotionally handle it by myself. Tell me a little bit more about it without spoiling it. I feel like I heard about it recently. Oh, okay, Barcam is back. Hello, Barcam. What do you guys think that is? I see Bacardi in the corner, but I'm not sure. I also wonder if he knows we're like showing this. This is giving me those vibes. Like one time we did a live stream where I was at home and then Mark went to go get like Jack in the Box. Guess, guess what drink I got you. No, I'm having everyone guess in the chat right now. Can you show it again one more time? Oh, what is that? It looks like a margarita. What do y'all think? Everyone's saying it's mojito. Well, we clearly didn't get the same drink. Your drink looks like a Jack and Coke. Mimosa? This late? I guess you can have it whenever. Sean says, I feel okay, like I'm, I'm like going to pay and then I'll be in the room. <laughs> oh, this is too much. Is your mic on? Is your mic on? I can't. I can't hear you. You mute. You're muted. Now, do you feel like you're on Zoom? Ooh, if you got me tequila sunrise, he wants something today. Mm hmm. I said what I said. I don't need no eel tail, contrary to popular belief. Y'all saw that. Uh oh. Eddie is like trying to stay awake right now. He's struggling. Oh, hell to the no. It better not be a Sandy Shandy. No. Mark's already had four shots in the meantime. You guys are too funny. Y'all are wild. Maybe, you know what would be really cool? Like a pipe dream of mine would be like one day we do like a meetup and we all stay at the same hotel and we just. Have a blast. Wouldn't that be so much fun? I might need to do some background checks on some of y'all, though. I don't trust all of you, though. You know who you are. If you're like me, that's who I don't trust. Exactly. I can be sassy without uh, without a few cocktails in me, y'all. Joy says, I'll plan it, girl. I don't know. You're, you're one I would be sussing about planning something like that. 
Are you going to make chicken soup for all of us? We'll see you in three years. <laughs> Hedy was patiently waiting for y'all to exit the room. Is he not? Yeah, he really is. He actually made a run for it and it was quite scary. We didn't catch it on the vlog, but he ran away. And with Sheba's, the worst thing you can do is to run after them because they think you're playing with them. And so they run further. So I'm like, hey, do sit. Like, I have to, like, talk to him as if I have something. I had no treats on hand. He finally just stood still and I was able to swoop him up. James, we stay at your place and see what happens. Girl, we only have a three bedroom house and one bedroom is already earmarked for us. I mean, we could fit some more people in the living room, perhaps. Keep Money says, need to do some screening interviews on Discord first. I like, I like. I haven't watched that movie though, Ray. But I, I'm assuming a bunch of people just get together and they have parties. Mark is whooping it up at the bar. I know, I felt like he made friends with everyone there. They're all trying to act cool, but he probably, like someone said, he's four shots in deep. Making his way back. I do cannot be bothered right now. Look. I like this. He's um more subdued now. Not super like antsy. Again, it might be rebuffering right now because the internet is telling me it's a poor connection, but we'll make do. We actually were even thinking about just going on live, but we're not physically here, and it's just the bedroom with Hadu chilling here but we decided against it i'm the candies yes we are visiting monterey for the weekend Ooh, they start dying one person at a time kind of like the movie clue i like that oh he's here he has a very concerned look on his face you survived thank you so much hold the okay. guy the guy kind of took a, lot, a while oh what in the world is your drink? Is this a Long Island iced tea? No. It looks kind of like not the right color, but close up. Okay, everyone guess this drink first. And what time do we have? We have the seven? 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 We should, we should end the stream probably. Okay. So we have a little bit of time. And then, okay, so guess this drink first. I don't know. Do you even want this because you're cold? <laughs> And then this is my drink. Everyone guessed mint mojito. Is that a mint mojito? Good mojito. Okay. So mojito. yeah. Everyone well, Lainey said old fashioned for yours. Not not correct. Hawaiian iced tea. Is there alcohol in that? Because that's not it. That's that would not be an option right now. It tastes like it. It doesn't really look like it. A lot of people are saying three people said old fashioned. It it does look more like tinge of like a what color should it be then more like a beautiful red like cranberry juice with water oh that's what like you know that pink red yeah yeah doesn't look that pink red. rum and coke no it's not rum and yeah, let me try i don't even know if i would know if i drink it would i know i don't know if you know Yeah, yeah, well, it's that based. You know, yeah, James got it. If Keep Funny is here, then she is. Here. She is here. Well, it's a Negroni. Negroni, like, it tastes like a Negroni, but color wise, it's kind of like, I don't know what the guy did to make it look. Uh, Darker, like mm. a crimson color. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Keep Bunny says Negroni. There you go. Negroni. Yeah. The drinks were only 20 bucks. That's really cheap for a hotel drink. And I tip four dollars. And then I said, Oh, it's for the room. And then he's like, Okay. And then when he gave me the bill, he's like, I gave him a card. He's like, Oh no, you could just charge it to your room. Mm. So I was like, Okay. So when we check out one and if we see a random $24. 
Charge. Yeah, make sure I don't get all sad. Like, <laughs> that's just $24. It's, it's the drinks that we ordered. Miss Ma'am, we didn't, we didn't touch no snack bar. There was no snack bar in here. Uh, I was going to guess Campari Spritz. Oh, yeah. See, that's really close. Campari. Well, Negroni is with Campari. This might be a stupid question. Is Cape Cod a drink? I know. I know, like, Cape Cod God. fish and chips. <laughs> J and M, hi Emjin. Glad to see you guys tonight, even if it's just for a bit. Yeah, I mean, we've been on since six. Uh, if you just joined right now and you're just interested in seeing the view that we had earlier, uh, rewatch the replay. We're just gonna be on for another 15 minutes. This is like a pre-dinner cocktail, and we're gonna hang out with you guys for just a little bit before we call our Uber and head off to dinner. But if you're all like wondering what's happening in between, uh, we vlogged most of. Trip. Should I vlog you all right now? No. <laughs> What's in Negroni, Linda asks. Negroni is with Campari, Vermouth, and Orange Peel? I'm trying to think if there's another component to it. But for mm. sure, it's Campari and Vermouth. They're, they're in it for sure. I would be one of those kids where it's like, you ask that question, and then after, my next question is, What's Campari? What's Campari? <laughs> what's Vermouth? Like, it just keeps going on. If someone asked me what those were, I don't know how I would even... Vermouth is a aperitif? Like, but I, what's an aperitif? I don't know. And then what's... I a, don't even know if A spirit? Is it a spirit? Spritz? Oh, it's a spritz. No, no, no. What? What are you asking? Oh, what's Vermouth? I think it's, uh, it's a flavoring... It's alcoholic flavoring agent, but it's more whiny. Like, mm. <laughs> mm. ooh, this mojito! Like, oh, you could cook with vermouth too. That's right. Yeah. I don't think I'm buzzed, but I did have a lot of. I felt like I drank some rum earlier today, and I feel like when I drink alcohol that I don't usually drink, then it hits me in a different way. Oh, I had gosh. some rum earlier. Yeah, and I got um, the jazz festival. James was so cute. <laughs> Trying so hard to be entertained, and he's like all tapping his feet on the floor. Charmin mojito, it's very pineapple y. Is that normal? It's a pineapple, right? He added rum and I think probably some pineapple juice. Yeah. Hey. Can y'all throw some pineapple oh, emotes? It's sweet. It's, it's like too sweet. Do you want to add some water to it? Will that help? I don't know. I'm like, do you want to add some? No, 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 I'll, just, I'll just have the sugar sh or later. <laughs> That's <laughs> sweet. That's what I was saying. Yeah. Was... I mean, better sweet than sandy. Oh, oh, oh no. He added, you know, the juice that comes. Um, was it that mystery juice that that lady was trying it, to sell? Well, yeah. That, you know, that deep, deep, deep orange. You know, like it starts with the L maybe. Is it. It, it's it's in the unrefrigerated juice aisle. Langers? It might be a Langer juice. Um, and that's really thick and sweet. I mean, we're on vacation, but I'm gonna when we get back home, I'm gonna ask Mark to make me a proper cocktail. He's been quite the mixologist as of late. Right? Mix. Look at all them pineapple emojis. Thank you, everybody. Chug it, chug it, chug it. Yeah, we'll chug it soon. Chug it. Chug it, chug it, chug it, chug it. James got all creative with the light. Well, because I know how, how much you like light too. It, so well without it, does it get dark? Oh yeah. You know. Earlier we had when the sun was setting when we first started the live, we looked so Golden and the light was beautiful, but now it's like dark outside. Oh, can I have some sun chips? I yeah. got them. Mark got me sun chips. The best flavor of sun chips is what? Before I show you. Oh, you might have seen it. Best flavor of sun chips, go. There's no debate. There's no debate here. Oh, oh, oh. What's up, Negroni? Um, Island County got better today, but it's still been pretty cold. It's cold. It was cold today. 
but the skies cleared up and it was um I think I started a fight in the chat because everybody's saying something else besides French onion. Only a handful of people. Oh, that was a screening test. Anyone that did not say French onion is not invited to our massive meetup. That we're did doing. other did people say the other one, the orange one, cheddar harvest? I harvest. think I did see a few cheddar. Okay, Mendo said cheddar. What's the, uh, what are some of the other ones? Sean out in left field said garden salsa or bus. That's the red bag, right? Oh, is it? Should we try that? Michael's favorite place for mojitos is Maryland Place in Old San Juan, Puerto Rico. I mean, I would love to try their <laughs> mojitos. Hi, Susan. Glad I could make it. Welcome. I don't know why I got mojito for you. I'm trying to be all creative. They didn't, it didn't look like they had the copper mug, so I didn't even ask for a Moscow meal. Were there people eating dinner there? Uh huh. Oh. Yeah. Uh -huh. Is there, so is there a place? I, I couldn't really tell, but is there a place to sit in front of the bartender or yeah. is, it's just they make drinks? That's and what the lady at the bar downstairs was said. It's like, yeah, there's a bar at the restaurant, but it's a service bar, meaning that there, you don't sit at the bar. Mm. But it's good to know now that you can just charge it to the room. Yeah. Can we just leave our glasses here? Yeah. Hmm. It actually makes sense. When we were walking back, one of the rooms had their blinds open. Now I was like, what's in there? And there was glasses. What would James have gotten if he went to the bar? He's he he's like a, he always doesn't know what he wants. I'm by drink schwul. <laughs> <laughs> like I can drink. I might sometimes be like, let's have shots. And then other times I'll be like, dirty martini, which isn't my signature drink, but it's because Mark drinks it. So sometimes I'm like, oh, it might be easier for the bartender to make. And then usually my fallbacks are. Well, no, I'm, I'm happy that he started to drink dirty martini because that makes me happy, right? Because it's like, it's, it's, a, it's a really good cocktail. But um, but in the beginning, before he started drinking it, like he was like, oh, that's so gross. Like he wouldn't like it. But then. When we go out to eat, and they're like, hey, what do you want? And I'm like, dirty martini. And as soon as James, for the very first time, says, I'll just make that too. I'm like, what? And that's when I know. Then we did he... it that night. <laughs> no. <laughs> but that's when I knew he probably didn't know what to order. And he didn't want the waiter to wait more to take our drink order. So he probably said, just make that too. And I think since then, you've learned to appreciate dirty martinis. Yeah. Right? We have Austin and ASMR fan here, y'all. Oh, happy Friday. We're closer to you, actually. Follow us, awesome Austin. They've been going live three times a day, so you don't need to be here for our lives in the future. <laughs> They're doing it three times a day, okay? We're just having some drinks before we head out to dinner. Okay, the, the chips made this more palatable. Is it three times a day? Two times a day. I've been seeing, yeah, two or three times a day. Happy vacay. Yeah, we we didn't plan it properly, but we are heading up north next month, but not quite where you guys are. So maybe we have to plan another trip when we're in that area. Squeeze that lime to take the sweetness away. But it's already entrenched in this <laughs> drink over here. No, your lime. Which oh, is there is a lime in here. <laughs> I was like, there Don't. wouldn't be a lime in my drink, but there would be in yours. Donna says, does anyone do it three times a day? Wait, I think we, like, cross-wired. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if anyone is doing it three times a day, let me know. They'd be eating only eel let kale. Let James know so he could be invited. Girl, Mark will give me the... The go ahead and be like, okay, well, that saves me the one time a day. Yeah, come back tired. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll come go after. No, I'll go after I'm through with you, boo. Try to get all cute. Come back tired. No, I'll be. <laughs> <laughs> come back tired. Don't bother me. Oh, Hanny's waving. What do you want, Hanny? Do you guys see that? He's like, oh, oh, oh. 
He's like, don't fight. Yeah. Oh, don't fight, don't fight. Yeah. Okay, no fighting, right, Heidi? Uh, we are in Monterey. Fan says, my eyes hurt so much from reading the comments for the past week. Moderating uh, live streams is a, oh. it's a lot of work. So shout out to all the mods on our stream. Thank you so much. Y'all are the best. Ellen, uh, these drinks were twenty dollars total, so I guess each drink was ten bucks each. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad for a cocktail, but it's not like from a pro. Uh, uh, hold on, I don't want to say professional because he might be, but it's not from a artis artisanal bartender or mixologist. Oh well, here's the difference. I feel like an um, artisanal mixologist would probably have their own fruit puree for their things. They're not using untwisted the langers from the Vons supermarket. I said what I said. It's fine. It's still making me feel good. It's super dog friendly here. Yeah. Monterey, the other day, yeah. Everywhere in Monterey, like all the restaurants are dog friendly. Hetty's been feeling his oats because everyone's been like, what is that? Oh, and we saw two other Shibas on the oh, way yeah. here, too, the other day. That was so cute. Yeah. But we were kind of stressed walking by them because we we're like, well, we don't know what we know what our Shiba's like. We don't know what your Shiba's like. And I'm sure enough, right when we walked past each other, they, they didn't all even care. Ignored, they all ignored I think they literally just went like this. <laughs> They're like, I'm not interested in anything. And I'm like, oh, okay. Typical Shibas. Yeah. That's the shiba -tude. Thank you, Foxy Brown Babe. Happy birthday, JM, and all the upcoming March birthdays, including me. Yes. Okay, I have to I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna do at least half right now. Because. Oh my gosh, I just saw that little crevice underneath the closet. Ah, that's where he was? Yeah. How cute. Eddie, that place sounds very specific. Any chance y'all been to the Tickle Pink Inn in Carmel? What? Tickle, tickle, tickle Pink, pink what? Inn. In where? What? Uh, maybe we'll be, well, so we're having dinner in Carmel tonight. So afterwards, we might just walk around just a little bit. But we're also going back there tomorrow when we can actually see everything too. So. Is tomorrow dinner also in Carmel? I think so. Oh, I think so, yeah. Yeah, yeah are there any cool gay spots here in Monterey? I saw at least three same sex couples today. Really? I only saw one. I saw two, but now that I think about it, we might have crossed them twice. <laughs> and it wasn't us. Just to confirm. It was like near the it, aquarium. It wasn't uh, our reflection. No, it wasn't <laughs> our reflection. No. Did your room come with a dog welcome kit? No. Although the front door to the hotel had little dog treats and dog water bowls. Yeah. I did not agree to the half, I guess. I need to drink more. Our mass meetup should be Puerto Rico. No passports needed. Dang. Or Hawaii. Kate, we're having French onion sun chips. I shouldn't eat too much because I'll spoil my dinner. The name sounds sus, but it's a really cute spot. So, like, it's cute. Like, is there a bar in there where we could just, like, hang out? Or do you have to... Oh. Oh, oh! Don't pay attention. He did the tap oh, 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 oh! The handums, it happens randomly. That's when Hedu, to me, is still a youthful spirit. Baba, she was accurate because we did say, but we said there might be a spontaneous, and here we are. But we're on the tail end. We've been on for almost an hour. Watch the replay because then you get to see the view from 
right outside our hotel room, which is just ocean. Unobstructed view of the ocean. People were making fun of us earlier because when you came on during the bar segment, they thought it was like a breaking news. And so I was like correspondent saying, hey, now checking in with Mark. He's at the bar. Let's see what he's picking up. <laughs> oh, Donna, you're not the first one. When people message us about Hadu and they spell his name, it autocorrects to Gary. So some oh, of our friends oh, even yeah. call him Gary, which is kind of funny. Is it going to be cold in Carmel? Oh, thank you, everyone, for the reminder. It's 7 o'clock. We should still be okay, actually. So I want to get this drink mostly done before we get off. You're getting there. Good job. I'm getting there, yeah. Where's there to go? He's underneath your chair. <laughs> Had you he's hit under the chair? Mark brought out the leash. Pearl Hour is a gay bar in Monterey. Okay, Lainey. If we end up there, we're going to take a picture and I'll send it to you. You want to go to Pearl Hour? Ooh. Am I going to get a pearl necklace there? I don't know where Hedy went. He's in the you know, state. Hey, stay. Oh, oh. Whatever. Relax, you're on vacation. <laughs> <laughs> Me That's relax. what we always say, yeah. Passion Fish at Pacific Grove. My gosh, that sounds like a restaurant we were looking up for some other trip we were going to take. That sounds like, oh yeah. Uh, or was it Wild Pasta. Fish? No, it was here. Oh. Fresh and fish. Oh. We'll yeah, consider we, almost, we almost made a reservation yeah. there. Thank you, Elaine. And what's the rusty mic? I don't oh, know. Oh, I'm getting rusty mics in the house. Oh, like oh. I read it as like a, a drink, like or, or like a thing. Mic? I don't know. Ask Mike. <laughs> what part of him is rusty? Mm. Baba, isn't it? I'm sure you love taking your fur baby whenever you. I mean, yeah, when you guys go to the tampering. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, any final thoughts before we end the stream? Are you doing well, great? I'm so glad that we were able to jump on a live for about an hour and a few odd minutes to say hi to everybody. Uh, I'm so glad that you all got to see a glimpse of our mini vacation here. Uh, watch the replay because then you get to really see how gorgeous our view from our room is. Mm -hmm. um, we showed a few minutes of that. We're also uh, oh. Oh, hey. <laughs> we're also uh, uh, blogging this trip. So whenever we're done and James is able to edit the video, then that will get uploaded. So you get to even see more of our vacation. Yeah. Okay, we love you all. Have a great rest of your weekend, and I think we'll see you Monday. Bye. Don't hold us to it, but, yeah, we'll, don't hold us to but it. we'll do our best. We love you. Bye. Bye.